Pulley tires. Hold on to your hat. You'll send it. I don't think it worked. Let me catch my breath. And get one for yourself, too. Cheers. <laughs> oh, still awful. Okay. Pull again. Put your back into it. All right. Pulling. Damn. Oh, damn. That was awful. Thanks for the leg. I feel better already. Cheers. Cheers. I say, let's not go anywhere tonight. Mm. Not oh. bad at all. Okay. Let's go check the generator. Are you sure? When my exo bursts seen and shouts, where the hell is my dead machine? I think I got this. Pull that lever, Sam. Shit. I ain't got it. Huh? You hear that? What, the music? Had we had some music? Amen to that. Hey, you! What the f Okay, let me fix this. I definitely got it now. Start it, sir. <laughs> now our job is... Let them be Wait. Uh, what the... Uh, by the way, care to tell me your story? Are you sure? Come on, sir. Unwind. Sure. Why not? When we buried the colonel, I just knew I had to leave. I just knew, Dad, he was waiting. Thanks for telling me, son. We were on the ropes by then. We had to take the deal. And that bastard wants to save the world? Bah! He's going to become a pirate with nukes. And that's it. <laughs> <sighs> I don't know. I don't think it's quite like that. He has... ideas. <laughs> ah! I'm king of the world! <clears throat> oh, good. I'm telling you, Sam, you're a nice guy. <sighs> I don't know. He's not a madman, Ed. I know, but still, yeah, to hell with him. Let's drink. <sighs> Come on, sir. <laughs> I'm telling you, Sam, you're a nice guy, but you lack respect. Respect of your elders. <laughs> uh, I'm, I mean, why aren't you drinking? Hey, Ed! <laughs> I'm here. You are there too? Weird. I, I need a drink. <laughs> oh, this is good. <laughs> mm. Not bad at all. <laughs> 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 
Amen to that. Now that's what I call a party. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ed. Ed. Oh, shh. What happened? Ed, I'm blind. What are we drinking? You're not blind, you're sleeping face down. And stop shouting. Oh, my head. Oh. <laughs> oh. My head. That's why I don't drink. Oh. Oh. It's terrible. But I feel better now. <laughs> Here, finish this. It will help a bit. Okay, if you say so. <clears throat> okay, while you're recovering, let's go back to the conversation we had yesterday. I do know where that fuel is, and it's not even that far. In an underground submarine base. The tunnels are half flooded, but still accessible. The entrance is in the Naval HQ building. Radiation's off the charts there, though. So I wouldn't even try without a protective suit. This building used to be a fire department, and I know they had some suits in case of an accident with one of the subs. Now the place is overrun by bandits, so it's not going to be a walk in the park, I guess. Think you can handle it? Okay. I guess some fresh air will do me good. I'll go get those suits. Thank you, Sam. I'll be getting ready here, too. Oh, you should take the stairs. Down there and through the door. Oh, I almost forgot. While going downstairs, could you reload the traps? The mutants do visit this place from time to time. I'll try to, Ed. There is one Molotov left. Take it. There are many dead bandits on the lower floor. You should have the materials for more if you need them. use.
boys, the fucker that killed Kors! You're going to pay for killing our pal, you bitch! Come and get it! I wonder if anyone's coming to avenge these jokers. Glad I had this. A hitman. I'm no hitman. You, you're not? Well, sorry for jumping to conclusion. It's my brother's fault. I wouldn't put it past him. 
it's because of him I'm hiding in this dump, eating overgrown lice. Oh, shut up, you damn beast! Can't wait to be roasted! Shut up! Piece of shit! Just like that brother of mine. He wants to take my car dealership. Well, my share in it. Car dealership? The Kovshinov brothers. Right to drive. What? Haven't you heard of it? You must be new in town. Everybody knows us. We deal in used cars from Japan. Quality ones. We started from scratch, against all odds. But once we get the business going, that bastard decided to fuck me over. I arrived at the office one day, and there's a new guard. And he won't let me in. He took all I had. Some brother he is. Angela, our accountant, was right. I should never have trusted him. Never. He brought it all down. Destroyed it all. Um... But the war... Ah, who cares? My brother fucked me over. Don't you see? <laughs> but I have a plan. You need to get inside our dealership. Get the incorporation documents from the safe box and bring them to me. Then I'll have proof. I'm not going to let him die a beggar, of course. He's a brother, after all. I'm not like him. But I will pull his poison teeth out. I will! Will you help me? You just need to get that bastard, my brother, to spill his half of the code. We only knew half each to show it was our joint effort. We were stupid. I was stupid. Only Angela knew the whole code. Get his half of the code. Open the safe box and bring me the documents. You will do it, won't you? Look, my half of the code is this. One, two... Three, four. Huh. What? Ah, no matter. Go, go now. I will wait for you here. Oh, we'll show that bastard. Now you'll see. Oh, now you'll see. You will. <laughs> the dealership is mine. So what do you got? Ain't opening this one. I think you know what kind of a man he is already. There's also clear. How did you? Who the hell are you? Name's Sam. I'm working for Tom. Ah, I know you. I saw you there. So, you are second American, huh? Ah, I heard you were supposed to be around. Well, come here. We'll show you what's what. We aren't called scouts for nothing, after all. So, first of all, beware of the bat wing roaming about. We haven't seen it, just heard it. And judging by its shouts, it's huge and angry as hell. And probably it's wounded. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind. Next, where did you need to go? To the fire depot. You can see it from here. The red building with the tower. It's about half a click from here as the crow flies. Right. But you don't look like a crow. It's close, but it's gonna be hard to get there. <laughs> yeah, crows have it easy in these parts. Look, that unfinished building from before the war. You need to go through it. That's the only way to the upper bog where the fire depot is right now. 
There's a gang that set up shop there, though. They used to do some slave trade. But lately they switched to the latest thing and started catching those human-like mutants. Can you imagine that? We've been at odds with them since forever. And anyway, they never like strangers. They're sure to open fire as soon as they see you. Don't expect a warning. So, try to remain unseen. Thank you. I will. What else have we got here? Ah, here. Look this way now. See that two-storied tower-like building on that islet? It used to be a police post before the war. Now it's taken over by a gang, too. Complete mad lads. Though they're busy catching the fuglies now, like the others. That business is on the rise over here, you know? What they have there is a warehouse of sorts. So there should be some good loot there. <laughs> that little islet supposedly houses a cache of sorts. A few years back, a new gang appeared in this town. Those were some crazy bastards, but they were good. They went and demanded tributes from gangs thrice their numbers, and murdered everyone who didn't pay up. They had training, spitznuts like They also had gear, like in the movies, armor, guns. Each of them had night vision, too. <laughs> they had a good run, ended up controlling a huge swath of the ruins, even with their numbers. Then the other gangs decided they had enough, got together and smashed them completely. So all that remains of them today are their caches marked by their sign. A skull wearing night vision goggles. So watch out for those. Why? I bet all those places were looted long ago. I wouldn't be so sure. Those guys were real show-offs. Each of their caches is like a puzzle box. The chosen ones in the know are supposed to get it. While random Joes like us are not. Huh. The boys did find hidden buttons opening doors a couple of times. But all through sheer luck, they never got the principle. Perhaps you'll get it, after looking at the situation with your unbiased American eye. <laughs> I might. You forgot the Fuglies. Ah, yes. Watch out on that islet with the cash. The Fuglies are especially large and tough there. I've no idea why, and I don't care. But these large ones are in demand, so the hunters don't clear them out. They just catch a couple from time to time and leave the rest to repopulate. Got it. So that's about it. We've been told to observe and render assistance if needed. We told you what we know. That should count. Thanks, guys. Good luck. See ya!
I could use that. Пригодится.
What's up with you, bro? Thank <laughs> you. 